Yes, the acceleration is centripetal, so A equals R omega squared, and we can substitute omega equals 2 pi over T. Then the right triangle gives us R equals D sine theta. And then we rearrange to get the expression for T in terms of acceleration A. Now we need the acceleration, which is where Newton's second law comes in. So the next step is to draw a diagram showing all of the external forces acting on the pig and their resultant. By the way, I've already used T for the period, so this time I'm going to use F for the tension in the string. But first, another question for you.